So, what we have here is <coughs> loot crate box. Therefore, basically what you get is a crate full of random goodies. And uh, each box has a theme. This one happens to be Unite 2.0. This is the base crate. The very basic, most basic one that you can get. And, uh... Yeah, the, you know, basically it. You, you get... It, it gives you an idea of the different franchises and stuff like that. And, uh... It gives you about five different franchises per box. But, uh... Yeah, it's kind of like Christmas for adults. The way I look at it, this is actually my first box, and I thought it would be pretty cool. Every box comes with at least uh, one graphic t-shirt. And, uh, let's see, what else here? What else does it come with? Uh, um, I know this one in particular, just because it was posted on the website, and Facebook, and everything else. It's the, the thing that got my attention, it's got a pop figure in it. I like pop figures. I paid about $22 for the box. But, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's crack her open and see what we get. First, show you the box. Yeah, that side says Loot Crate. Uh, so all the sides say Loot Crate. That one has absolutely fucking nothing on it. And obviously the top says Loot Crate. Alright. Anyways, let's crack her open. That's a knife. If you can't tell, that's a knife. Make sure you was able to see that. Anyways, let's cut her open here. Alright. Let's see what we got here. It's full of nerdy stuff. I know that. Stuff for nerds. People can call me a nerd, they can call me whatever they want to call me. But guess what? <laughs> You're never gonna see what's in here. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but uh First of all, uh, for the fact of surprise, I'm not going to show you the entire box at once. I'm going to pull out the item one at a time. So I'm trying to push it to the side here so you can't see the entire box before I get everything new. Anyways, first we have Widowmaker Pop Figure. Uh, these go for about. I'm not entirely sure. Probably about $15 themselves, and the box advertises for $15 plus shipping, which was like, ah, uh, I don't know, like $6 or something. But, uh, anyways, yeah. Widowmaker from Overwatch. Actually happens to be a winter skin. Uh, I think you can actually get this skin on the game. Uh, I'm not entirely sure, but yeah, this is basically the main reason I got the box. It's because I like Overwatch a lot. And it's pretty damn cheap for a pop figure. Oh, still. Anyways, there's that. Yeah, let me set it to the side here. Yeah, I don't know if you can see that. Uh, I don't have the greatest setup right now, but I do have a tripod. Anyways, here we have... Sevens Power Rangers Unite. Uh, everybody knows what Power Rangers is. Uh, I know my uh, big cousin always loved Power Rangers when I was a kid. So I'll probably give this to him. But anyways, it is a Loot Crate exclusive. As well as this, actually, if you can't tell. Let me get you a nice close-up of that. Yeah, right there. It says Loot Crate exclusive on it, which is nice. Very nice, actually. I like that. And this is also a Loot Crate exclusive. But, you know, might not even end up keeping it. Anyways, it says 4 out of 5. So I guess you can get more out of it. And, uh, you can pause the video here if you want to, if you want to read that. Jittery. Too much coffee. I love coffee. That's why I'm always jittery. Anyways, uh, you know what? We'll do the t-shirt last. At least you know it's black. Next, we will do. Nah, uh, we'll do. We'll get the boring, the, the 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 very boring part out of the way. Uh, it is a pin. Unite 2.0, November 2017. By the way. This is for November 2017. But, uh, yeah, you're not too fun open. 
seen other videos. I know they all come with pins. Nice pin. Not gonna lie. Don't know what I'd put it on. They're probably saying this. And I'll collect them as I get them. Next we have comic book. It's Justice League America. I guess it's oh the Justice League of America. I didn't know Justice League was uh, I don't know apparently a planetary thing. Honestly, you'd think it'd be interplanetary. Now I'm doing an Irish accent. Because to be honest with you, I can do a completely American accent. But I'm talking like this because I want to. It's a little more interesting. Oh, you know what? I'll do this accent now. Anyways, here we have Justice League of America. And it has a certificate of authenticity. You can see that. Anyways, Justice League of America. Let's see it here too far back, but I know you guys want to see that, that's why you're watching the video. Not because the comic book in particular, some people don't even care for comic books. Me personally, I was never a huge fan of comic books, yeah, but I definitely understand the respect behind them as to why people collect them. Very nerdy people, but there's nothing wrong with being a nerd. I just happen to be a nerd more for games. Therefore, I'm probably switching to the gaming crate after this one. Anyways, next we have... Let me sit, scoot this to the side a little bit here. Oh yeah. Before I glance at this, this looks nice. $10 gift card to the premium. And uh, if you don't know what Verve is, or VRV, whatever you want to call it, they actually have Bravest Warriors. You can watch. The other seasons of Bravest Warriors on YouTube, I know you can do that, but uh, I know VRV actually uh, continued the series after many years. Doing a terrible accent right now. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I know they continued the series after many years. And yeah, it's, it's, it's a very... Very good TV show, Bravest Warriors is. And you know, everybody knows what Dragon Ball Z is. I have no idea what Harmon Quest is. But, um. Yeah. Very, very nice TV show. Bravest Warriors is from the original creators of Adventure Time. I think they actually were working on that TV show before they ever worked on Adventure Time. So that tells you how old it is. And it took them a really long time to come out with, uh, I think it was season three. Anyways, let's continue. Here we have a t-shirt. I've got it upside down. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's so fucking cool. Oh, man. Too bad you guys never get to see that. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. But, uh, yeah, it's a Voltron t-shirt. I thought it looked, uh, pretty nice, pretty nice. You know. Honestly, looks like something I see a kid wearing in first grade. You know, I mean, some people might love it, you know what I mean? But I'll probably wear it around the house or something just to look like a super geek. You know, there's nothing wrong with that. But all in all, these are quality t-shirts. I'm not going to lie, they feel nice. Very nice. Good, good t-shirts. But, um, yeah, you know, pretty decent. Voltron Legendary Duff. Defender, Defenders, I don't know, it looks like it, they did a little bit of a bad job printing it out there, but uh, yeah, making sure you guys are able to catch all of that, anyways, and I believe that's it for this crate, oh yeah, yeah, I forgot to show you something though, obviously that, that's cool, $10 gift card, I'll probably end up using it. And, uh, I've never opened this, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, let's, let's, let's open it up and see what we got. If I can get it out, that'd be nice. Uh, let's see, ooh, it's a blue Power Ranger with a little token there, that's pretty cool. Uh, looks like it connects together with other Power Rangers or something like that, so, 
I don't know what I, I don't know if they expect you to get like four more boxes or something like that and hopefully you get all the colors you want or probably it's, they're probably collectibles so you can like sell them online in about 10 years or something like that and make probably, I don't know, probably like 30 40 dollars off of it but you can't beat it because you get all the other goodies too anyways uh yeah that little dude like i said it's never a huge fan of power rangers but you know uh you know i am going to put it back in there i mean i will after the video but that's too much hassle right now and uh Nice, pretty nice box. Uh, it was all right. What I really wanted was this. Like some nice little decor for my room. Uh, just some advertisement stuff. Who cares about that? And then we have Unite 2.0 Loot Crate, November 2017. I guess it's like a little book of sorts that tells you about the box. Maybe gives you a little story. I don't know. I know I'm subscri subscribed to Dollar City. Dollar Shave Club as well. I don't know why I'm getting so tongue-tied right now. But uh, I'm subscribed to that as well. And they give you like little books and stuff to go with it, I guess, to read, like, shave your beard or something. I don't freaking know. But, uh, yeah, I guess that's it. Sorry, I didn't mean to hit the table. That was probably kind of loud on the camera. I got my camera up here on a little tripod. Oh, yeah. And you can make the box all inside outwards and it'll make it look cool and stuff. I ain't gonna do it on the video, but you know, some people probably like doing that. Anyways, all in all, my thoughts on the box. It's pretty nice. This is based more on like pop culture and stuff, and this one had a specific Unite theme, which, you know, had a lot of Justice League and Power Rangers. And Overwatch, of course. Love Overwatch. <laughs> I think that's the second or third time I've said that in this video. But, uh, all in all, it's pretty nice. But, um, I'll probably subscribe to the, uh, the gaming crate, to be honest with you. Because I feel like I would be able to geek out on that a little bit more. Like, I, 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 I saw last month's crate, and I was like, yeah, I probably would like more stuff out of that. You know, this one, superheroes are cool and all, you know. But... I mean, honestly, they're really cool. Like, I'm not dissing anyone who likes comic books and Justice League and stuff like that, or Power Rangers, like, or uh, Voltron or anything like that. You know, it's just, yeah, you know, not my kind of stuff. But I figured all the little surprises would be kind of cool, you know. That, and I wanted a random t-shirt. I wouldn't know what the t-shirt would be. I mean, the t-shirt could have been, you know, Justice League related. It could have been Overwatch related. It could have been Power Rangers related. It could have been Voltron related. Who knows? I highly doubt Overwatch rated. Not rated. Related. <coughs> because, uh, yeah, you already get one Overwatch item in here. I guess you get about, uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five items per box. Five themed items. And then the rest is for an overall theme. And then you get other promotional things, like, I guess, gift cards and stuff per box. But, uh, yeah, all in all, it's pretty nice. I like it. Uh,. Like I said, I'll probably subscribe to the gaming crate. It was, I think it's like $8 more or something like that, but yeah, I'll probably subscribe to it. Anyways, have a good day.